Hi friends, and welcome back to my computer screen. If this is your first time here, hello and welcome. My name is Crystal, and this is normally a place where I share my memory keeping projects and processes with all of you guys, but we are doing something a little different this month, and on Tuesdays I am sharing some Photoshop tutorials to show you guys what I do behind the scenes before we ever get to my desk. So today, I am going to walk you guys through how I print my photos with white borders around the outside edges. So I have this photo pulled up right here and I already have it edited the way I want it to be. So what I'm going to do is go over and click on the crop tool on the left hand sidebar. And then up at the top, I am going to toggle the uh, ratio to be width by height and that just allows me to put in my own measurements for those and I cropped that photo to be 2.75 inches wide by 3.75 inches tall. Then I opened up a new canvas. So I went up to file and hit new and in the menu I uh, created my own dimensions again and I made this canvas at three inches wide by four inches tall with a white background. So now what I can do is I can go back to my photo, select all, so I'm going up and selecting all of it, and then I can copy it and go back over to the white canvas and paste my image right onto there. It will automatically paste it into the exact middle of that canvas so I don't have to move the image around in there. And then all I need to do is go up to layers and merge the visible layers. So now that photo is one full layered, you know, one full layer photo. Okay, so I'm just going to X out of that one. I don't need to save it. So let's do this again, uh, but this time we're going to do a four by six inch photo. So again, this one I already have um, edited the way I want it to be. Again, I'm gonna hit that crop button and up at the top, I'm going to type in my measurements. So this is going to be 5.75 by 3.75. Also, I keep my resolution at 300 pixels per inch. And that is the same on the canvas as well. So I went ahead and cropped that photo down. And now I am going to, well, I forgot what I was doing here, I think, because I copied it, but I don't have anywhere to put it. So I opened up a new, so again, file new. And then over here on the menu side, I am going to put my width as six inches wide by four inches tall. Again, 300 pixels per inch, hit okay. I have a white background and there is my canvas. So now I can paste that image directly onto the canvas. Again, it goes into the middle, so I don't have to do anything with that. Then I'm going to merge the visible layer. So layer, merge visible layer. And that is my four by six inch photo. So that one is just ready to be printed on four by six inch um, printer paper, not printer paper, photo paper. Now for that three, inch by four inch photo that I need to actually put onto a larger canvas so I can print it. So we're gonna pretend like I have two separate photos and in fact, I'm just gonna use the exact same one to show you this. So I selected it all and I copied it and then I pasted it on here. Now with the move tool, which is the one that looks kind of like a, a compass or whatever that's called. It looks like arrows. <laughs> I am going to move the photo all the way to the edge and then I'm going to paste. We're going to pretend that's a different photo even though it's the same. And I pasted that and moved it onto the opposite end of the photo. So now I can merge those layers if I want to and we are ready to print. So that is it for this tutorial, you guys. I hope that this helps you. If you have any questions, let me know. And keep your eyes open for next week when I release my next Photoshop tutorial in this series. Until then, I hope you guys have a fabulous day and I will catch you in the next video. Bye now!